Andy Social, our referee, as Jared Busmakers gets set to come out of the blue corner in the black and white trunks, black and blue trunks for Josh Griffin out of the red corner. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Hard Knocks Fight Breakdown. My name is Jeremy Valentine. This is a fight between Jared Busmakers coming out of the blue corner, Josh Griffin coming out of the red corner, both fighters with similar records, and again, a good matchup for both these guys. Here's the first instance we're going to talk about. It's a nice switch over by Jared Busmakers, and it's off of a Josh Griffin mistake. Griffin is going to step up really high when he's in the half guard. As soon as Busmakers gets a hold of this ankle, as you see here, he's going to swing around his legs violently under Underneath Griffin to be able to get the switch. Here's another look at it, and he gets through, and it's because it's violent, it pushes Griffin back far enough where bus makers can get out and get on top. And that doesn't always happen with that switch. Here's a look at bus makers attempting the same kind of position as he's stepping up, but he's very high up on Josh Griffin's hip. He, he doesn't have the same opportunity. He's also baiting Griffin and giving him an opportunity to get an arm bar. And Griffin says, hey, I'll take that arm bar. But the whole time, bus makers trying to come through and land some big shots, including those three hammer fists to the face of Josh Griffin. Here's the end of round one. There'd been some damage, but nothing really significant. But this is a good last 10 seconds from Jared Busmakers. He's landing some big shots. He's not necessarily worried about Josh Griffin stopping him because he knows he can stop some positions. Here's early in the second round and it's a nice karate combination here from Josh Griffin but here's the mistake. Griffin has him against the cage and needs to pressure forward. Instead, he takes a step backwards and he gives Busmaker time to get out, to relax, to breathe and when he gets this, including this big knee which lands on, right on the nose of Josh Griffin which opens it up pretty big, uh, that was a mistake stake by Griffin. He really needed to come forward. This is an excellent triangle by Josh Griffin. He's got it in nice and tight. Got some pressure down on the head of Jared Busmakers. He's going to try and reach up to the head right now. As you see, he adjusts the grip to make sure the grip is good. And then he's going to reach the head. Now here's where Busmakers is going to go a two on one and he's going to grab the arm of Josh Griffin right there and by doing that he doesn't allow Josh Griffin to get his hands linked together to pull down on his head to put the real pressure that's needed on the triangle however the triangle is very tight it took Busmakers a while to get up here's in the third round and here's a lazy takedown by Jared Busmakers and I say lazy because it was not from lack of his trying, Josh Griffin just didn't seem to defend it. He had an opportunity to step out right here, get his hips back, but he didn't do so. And Busmaker's able to get a nice, easy takedown and get top position. And throughout the, the match, this is something that Busmaker is is doing. Uh, Josh Griffin uses utilizes a butterfly guard very effectively, but what... Busmakers was doing is every time that the right foot ended up in his hip, he would take that foot off of his hip, grab a hold of the heel, and push it down to make it so that Griffin can't use any muscles to get out of this position. He has to change positions, which leaves him open for a shot. That's a butterfly guard used effectively by Griffin, but Busmakers right on top of him, getting on top. Here's again, that foot went to the hip, and Busmakers immediately removes it so that he can maintain top position, which is very important for Busmakers' game here, because when Josh Griffin was in top or when standing, he had a little bit of an advantage, whereas uh, Busmakers, once he was on top, was using his striking, including these elbows here, started to cut open Josh Griffin some big shots that landed and again continuing to stay busy on top which is very important here's again just some posturing up and you can see the face of Josh Griffin has just eaten some huge shots and I'm going to let you finish out the end of the round which is a unanimous decision victory by Jared Busmakers enjoy he's going to take this flurry out a huge elbow now to the face of Josh Griffin and Griffin in trouble the winner by unanimous decision in the blue corner Jared the Tapa Busmakers Jared Busmakers a big win for him pushes his record to five and three he's gonna be in the center of the cage